Hi everyone, I'm Mallory and I'm here to show you a 2019 Subaru Outback Limited located at Thousand Islands Toyota at 555 Stewart Boulevard in Brockville, Ontario. As you can see, the exterior color is called Abyss Blue Pearl and has 136,142 kilometers on it. This vehicle also has a 3.6 liter flat six cylinder gas engine and can put out 256 horsepower with a torque of 247 pounds per foot. This Outback uses 12 liters per 100 kilometers in the city and 8.7 liters per 100 kilometers on the highway for fuel economy. By the way, if you like these videos and want to see more, please like and subscribe to our page so we can keep them coming. Now let's hop in and take a look at some of our interior features. All right, so first we're gonna take a look at the driver's side front interior door panel. So starting just up here, you have your memory driver's seat. Down here you have your power mirrors, your power locks, child safety locks, and power windows with a nice door handle just in behind that. And then down at the bottom, you have a small compartment with a cup holder in it and a speaker off to the side. Quick look at our front interior here, which is leather upholstery and you have power seats. You also have a leather steering wheel as well. Just looking at some of the controls here, a little hard to see with the sun, but you have your power lift gates, you have traction control, blind spot monitor, lane departure alert, and front collision alert. And now looking in here, we're gonna take a look at some of our steering wheel audio controls. So these controls over here control your radio. So you have your volume, you can change the radio station. Here you have AM, FM, and satellite radio. So just by clicking here, you can switch between those three and you also have voice recognition right here. So there is a Bluetooth connection. You can also pick up a phone call or hang up a phone call. And then over here, you have your cruise control and your settings for your cruise control just right there. And just down here, you can also see this is a heated steering wheel as well. Jumping up here to take a look at the odometer. Over on the left hand side at the top, you have your RPM. At the bottom, you have your temperature gauge for your coolant. Just to the right, you have your digital screen, which up top tells you the average, um, average liters per hundred kilometers that you're burning, how many kilometers until the tank of gas is empty. You also have down at the bottom, you can see uh, which gear you're in and how many kilometers are on the vehicle. And then over on the right hand side, you have your speedometer at the top with miles per hour on the inside. And then you have your fuel gauge down at the bottom. Just jumping over here to take a look at our radio. So this is an eight inch touchscreen radio. So like I said before, you have your FM, your AM and your satellite radio just right over here. You also have a navigation system. And if you click on to settings, we go to, sorry, not settings. If you click on apps, you can see that you have Android Auto and you have Apple CarPlay just right here. We'll go back to radio. You also have a CD player just up top here. And now we're gonna take a look at the rear view camera. So this is what the backup camera looks like. And now just coming down here, you do have a dual zone climate control. If we turn it on, you can see there's dual zone climate control. You also have heated drivers and passenger seats. And right here you have your rear window defrost and your heated mirrors. And then your, all of your controls for the climate control with your push button start all over here. Just jumping down here, you can see that you have right in here a 12 volt outlet, auxiliary input, and then two USB-A ports. You have a nice leather wrapped gear shift knob and some of your cup holders. And then back here you have your electronic parking brake, lifting up our glove compartment just in here, or sorry, our center console. You have another 12 volt outlet just right there. And as you can see, lots of room. You can store your purse or your wallets or anything that you may need just down in there. Jumping up here, taking a look at the rear view mirror. This is an auto dimming rear view mirror. Right here, you have your integrated garage door opener. Up top here, you have not only a sunglass holder, but you have map lights just right here. Let's not forget, while we're up here, you have a power tilt sliding sunroof. And then down here, you have a glove compartment. Great for storing any maintenance bills for the vehicle or any manuals that you may have. 
And you can see over here on the passenger side that you have your power locks and power windows over there as well. And now we're gonna take one last look over here at the passenger seat. Now let's hop out and take a look at some of the exterior features. All right, so now we're gonna take a look at some of the exterior features as we go up the driver's side. So starting up at the front, you have your LED daytime running lights. You have your fog lights down here. Coming up along the side, you have 18 inch, sorry, 17 inch steel wheels. Now you do have 18 inch alloy wheels that come with the vehicle as well. You also have integrated turn signal mirrors with a roof rail up on top. You now we get a better view of the driver's side. We're gonna come along and take a look at the rear of the vehicle. And you can see, like I said before, here is your second set of tires. So it already has a winter tire on it. Those are the summers. You have a power lift gate. We're just gonna lift this up and take a look at some of the features back here in the trunk. So you have a nice rubber floor mat back here. You also have some tie down cleats that you can see just right here. You can see you also have car seat anchors for the, for the row of, of, in front of you. And you also have over here, if you have heavy bags, you can easily just click onto this and you can put your heavy bags here and it'll hold them down. And you also have some speakers back here. And then when you're done, you just click this button here and the trunk goes down just on its own. And there you have it. Now let's hop in and take a look at some of our interior rear features. All right, so now we're gonna take a look at our driver's side rear interior door panel. So here, all you have is just your power windows for controls on the back door, but you have a nice door handle just in behind with cup holders just down below and then a speaker off to the side. Quick look here at our rear interior, which is leather upholstery as well. And these seats are a 60-40 bench seat split to easily fold them down. You click this button here, they fold down. You easily pop them back up and that button is just right here. You just press it down and away you go. And you can also see that you have car seat anchors. You have two on the driver's side, two over here on the passenger side with a little armrest in the middle that folds down into two cup holders. You also have back here two seat back storage pockets, one in behind the driver's seat, one in behind a passenger seat. And then in the middle here, looking at some of our features, you have your heater ducts, rear heated seats, and then two USB-A ports just in the middle here. And then as you can see over on the passenger side, you have your power windows over there with a nice map light just in the middle. And now we'll take one last look at the rear interior. That was a look at our 2019 Subaru Outback in Abyss Blue Pearl. If this is the type of vehicle you're looking for, please give us a call at 613-342-9111 and one of our product advisors would be happy to assist you with a test drive. For more information on this vehicle, you can visit us at thousandislandstoyota.com or email sales at thousandislandstoyota.com. If there's anything you're interested in, please let us know in the comment section and I'll make sure to address it in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our page. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.